Right guys, welcome back to the channel and I've got a little bit of a care package that I've picked up from our sponsors, Wargames, Martin has very kindly packaged this up and sent it over to me for any of your hobby needs at all. Go and check out wargamesuk.com for discount on all of your hobby related products, especially Games Workshop and things like that. So, what have I got in the box? What is coming to the channel soon? Well, first of all, I'm going to actually move it out of the way. We have Shadow Wars Armageddon. I'm looking forward to playing this. Can't wait. I'm not going to go through the details of the box because there's a million one videos online showing what is in the contents of the box. But over the course of the next few weeks, I'll hopefully get the scenery and everything painted up. Uh, and we can get a campaign on the go on the channel. I know there's a few of us wanting to get into that. So, that is the first thing. But, the next thing is a new army. But what? Beast Claw Raiders. For Age of Sigmar, of course, I've heard Beast Claws are a bit brutal, but they're not very many in number. So I had a very quick look at the General's Handbook for points wise. Uh, of course I picked up the Battle Tome, uh, which I'm quite excited to look forward, uh, looking forward to going through and seeing exactly what stuff does. Uh, I've picked up a Stonehorn, which I think can be built as a Thunder Tusk and I think there's three different things that you can put on top. So like, I think one's a Frost Lord uh, and then you've got ones that are a Battle Line. But, the biggest value for money, not only is it value for money if you buy it from Games Workshop, it's even further discounted from Martin. So, I've picked up this, the Icewind Assault Box. I think it's normally about 135, 114 from Martin. So, great discount there. Um, looking at this, there's quite a lot of models in it actually, so I think they must be the Mornfangs. Um, we've got two of the big guys there, some yetis, the hunter, and some sabers as well. And I've heard, apparently, some of these are actually uh, fine cast, which I didn't think Games Workshop actually sold in boxes. There's no star collecting box for Beast Claws, so this is basically the next best thing. Ah, there you go. So we've got Mornfangs, uh, we've got the yetis. Got the hunter and the sabers. He's massive. He's really big. And I'm not going to go through all of this, but there's a lot of plastic there. But considering this, what come, what I've got here combined with the other stone horn and things, comes to around about 2,000 points. And correct as I'm wrong, I think it's eight. Uh, 10, 13, 14, 15 models all together. So throughout May I'm going to be posting videos uh, showing me progress on this army. I'm hopefully going to magnetize the big guys because there's so many different ways that you can run them. But you will see progress um, of the army as it is built of course. Uh, I might even get a cheeky magnetization video in once I've done one or two of them. Uh, and when I get the last one, I kind of know I'm doing a bit more. We'll maybe try and get a magnetization video. But this, I'm looking forward to reading this and seeing exactly what can be done with these guys. See what battalions there is and so forth. So in another video, we'll have a look through this. But that is what you can expect coming up on the channel over the next few months. Uh, like I said, for any of your hobby needs, go and check out War Games for great price and fast delivery. So massive shout out to Martin for sending these over as quickly as what he did. So thanks very much for watching, folks, and we'll see you next time.